Some people look at a flag swaying in the breeze at the White House and they say, that's America. Me, whenever I see a, an American flag hung in the window of a basement apartment by guys who have better things to do with their money than buy curtains, <laughs> I say, that's America to me. In America, there are 51 states, or maybe it's 80 by now. Does England count? I'm not quite sure. The one thing I am sure of, though, is if I'm standing in a warehouse beside a time clock and a guy is punching in for his best friend who is too hungover to get out of bed, I'm standing in America, the makeover capital of the world, the place where every young man has to answer in his heart the question, what do you love more? your girlfriend or your car. <laughs> and where that young man can buy a beat up car for $300 and has to spend a thousand to insure it. <laughs> where else can even a paper boy option the film rights to a book? A woman on an assembly line works out her overtime in her head to infinity. And at the exact same moment, her husband gets into a car accident because he's looking at a girl in a tube top. <laughs> in America, where spelling doesn't count, people's pets do. Where else can a guy get a job riding a whale at Marineland? But in America. In America, a guy's girlfriend breaks up with him over the phone. So he gets a gun and kills the principal. Everyone is sad until they get the day off. Next week, uh, another guy, another gal, another we can still be friends, phone call. Uh-oh, the assistant principal gets it. And everyone's sad, because they don't get the day off. Because he's just the assistant principal. America, a land of opportunity. Yes, that great lumbering beast that journeys tirelessly, stops only to eat a clubhouse sandwich, pick its teeth with a matchbook cover, and fall asleep with the TV on. Again, America. A place for Americans.